Well, now at 5.30, a comet narrowly misses Mars over the weekend. Now, it hurled past the red planet yesterday afternoon at a speed of 126,000 miles an hour, and scientists say that's a big deal. Meteorologist TJ Del Santo spoke with a local professor about this close call. He joins us now with the details, new at 5.30. Comet sighting spring has been working its way into the inner solar system for millions of years. And yesterday it had a close call with the planet Mars. Since humans were just starting to roam the Earth, comet sighting spring has been on its journey into the inner solar system. Originally when it was first discovered, they thought it actually had a trajectory that took it in a collision course with Mars. However, it just came very close to Mars. In fact, the comet came within 86,000 miles of Mars, about a third the distance between the Earth and the Moon. It had no impact on the red planet, but the dust particles in the tail could have wreaked havoc with various spacecraft in orbit there. Those particles, as they uh, travel at such a high speed, uh, are very likely to cause damage to a spacecraft. The spacecraft were maneuvered to the other side of the planet and out of the trajectory of the comet in its tail. The cameras, however, were pointed at the comet because there's a lot that can be learned from these travelers of the solar system. They represent what the solar system was like four and a half billion years ago. Scientists here at Brown University and around the world will study the pictures to learn more about comet sighting spring, its origin, and what could have happened if it made a direct hit on Mars. And the pictures of the comet from the spacecraft on and around Mars will be coming in in the days ahead. With the Providence Mobile Newsroom, I'm TJ Del Santo, Eyewitness News.